Hey guys, welcome to the channel. In this video we're discussing the best remote software for gaming. So if you want to game from anywhere in the world, I'm going to demonstrate to you and of course show you the best uh, software uh, for the games. If you want to re play remotely, say on your maybe gaming computer from your laptop or something. So let us begin guys. So before we get into picks, let us cover what matters the most for remote gaming. So firstly, low input latency, so your controls don't lag. After that, higher frame rate support, ideally 60 FPS or higher. Uh, good resolution scaling, 1080p minimum, 4K if possible. Gamepad and peripheral support, especially for console-like experience. And of course, stability, no random disconnects during a boss fight. And this takes us to the first contender, or should I say contenders, which is Moonlight plus Sunshine Combination. So Moonlight is an open source client that streams your desktop during NVIDIA's game stream protocol. Uh, if you've got a GeForce GPU, this is the lowest latency remote gaming experience you can get. Uh, pair it with Sunshine, the game stream compatible host app for any GPU, and you can stream even from AMD or Intel machines. So in terms of the pros and cons, uh, extremely low latency, uh, free and open source, uh, 4K 120 FPS streaming possible, supports gamepads and touch input. Uh, in cons, uh, requires manual setup and works best on local networks. And now, if most of your games are on Steam, uh, Steam Remote Play is built in and free. You can stream from your gaming PC to another PC, laptop or even mobile. Uh, in pros and cons, uh, dead simple to use, control friendly, good quality over LAN or fast internet. Uh, now in cons, uh, limited to games in your Steam library, less customization compared to Moonlight. Now the next contender is Parsec, this one is a favorite for remote play, co-op gaming and even cloud hosted setups. It focuses heavily on low latency and works across Windows, Mac, Linux, even Raspberry Pi. So pros and cons once again, excellent latency, sharp visuals, easy to set up, supports multiplayer sessions. Uh, in cons, free for personal use, but pro features require a subscription. Some users report minor quality drops on Wi-Fi. And now NVIDIA GeForce Now. So if you have no gaming rig, no problem. GeForce Now lets you stream games you own from the cloud, even AAA titles at ultra settings. Uh, so in pros and cons, no need for a gaming PC, uh, very low latency on good internet, wide game support. Cons requires fast, stable internet, free tier has wait times, some games not supported. And lastly, we have Chiaki or PS Remote Play. So console gamers, yes, you too. Uh, Chiaki is a open source PlayStation Remote Play app, or you can use official PS Remote Play and Xbox Remote Play apps to play your console titles remotely, even on PC or mobile. So in pros and cons, seamless for console owners, console UI and gamepad support. Uh, console must be on and uh, configured properly and can be laggy without a strong connection. So whether you're on LAN, at home or streaming over the internet, there's a remote desktop solution perfect for your setup. Personally, I would go with Moonlight plus Sunshine for the lowest latency or Parsec uh, if you want a fast plug and play experience across devices. So let us know about your favorite uh, remote gaming software and services and of course check the video description for links and of course also smash that like button subscribe and i'll see you in the next one